magnitude and direction cosines into Cartesian form in three dimensions. Start with B. B is a vector. It's 47.2 newtons with alpha between B and the positive x-axis of 25 degrees and gamma between B and the positive z-axis of 70 degrees. The first thing to remember when you're dealing with direction cosines is that even if you're only given two of the angles, you can always find the third one. We have, by the Pythagorean theorem and the definitions of our direction cosines, cosine squared of alpha plus cosine squared of beta plus cosine squared of gamma is equal to 1, where alpha, beta, and gamma are between B and the x, y, and z axes, respectively. So we know that alpha is 25 cosine squared of 25. We know that gamma is 70. We can solve this to find whatever the other direction cosine is. In this case, beta is 75.62597, etc., 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 degrees. Now you have your three direction cosines. To find the Cartesian coordinates, bx is the absolute value of b, the length of b, times cosine of alpha. by is the length of b times cosine of beta. And, amazingly, bz is the absolute value or length of b times cosine of gamma. We have all of these numbers. That's the length of b is 47.2. Alpha is 25, gamma is 70, and we just found beta. Beta was 75.6, etc., etc., etc. You can multiply these out. Bx is 42.777, By is 11.7174, Bz 16.143. Now remember, you want to always answer your question with units and three significant digits. So B, in Cartesian form, is 42.8, 11.7, and 16.1 newtons.